three Irish single pot still whiskeys, all in the same price range, all owned by the same company. Which one should you get? Let's find out. Welcome to Four Leaf Whiskey. I'm Stacy, and today we're going to be trying three single pot still whiskeys owned by Irish distillers. We have Green Spot, Red Breast Well, and Powers Johns Lane. All three are about the same age. All three are about the same price point. All three are very different. So let's start with Green Spot. Of the three, Green Spot doesn't have an age statement on the bottle, although the liquid inside is 8 to 11 years old. Made up of 25% ex sherry cask and 75% new and refill bourbon cask, the ABV is 40%. Right away on the nose, you get caramel and big green apple notes. Green Spot is known for the green apple notes. So how does it taste? That green apple comes through prominently. If you like a sweet whiskey, this is a good one to pick. Get green apple, caramel, saltwater taffy. Great whiskey for summer. Next, we're gonna try Red Breast 12. Red Breast 12 was finished in ex Oloroso sherry casks and left in those casks for two years. So it has a much more prominent sherry note than the other two. Red Breast 12 is 40% ABV and has probably the most classic Irish whiskey taste. On the nose, you definitely get fruit from the sherry influence and those classic Irish shortbread cookie notes. In the palate, you get more honey. Again, the shortbread cookie, dried fruit, baking spice. The pot still comes through more in the Red Breast 12 than it does in the Green Spot. The last whiskey in the lineup is Powers John's Lane. John's Lane is a 12 year age statement whiskey and is mainly finished in bourbon casks. There's not as much of the sherry influence. John's Lane is also the highest ABV at 46%. On the nose, you get more of the toffee, vanilla, more honey and much more of the baking spice coming through on the pot still. The heavy bourbon cask influence really comes through on the palate. It is the spiciest of the three. You're getting those baking spices at the finish. A little apricot, vanilla, and you definitely can get more of the wood on the John's Lane as opposed to the other two. So which one should you get? All three are great examples of Irish single pot still whiskey. All three are made by Irish distillers and all three are right in the same price range of about $65 to $68. It just depends if you like a sweeter whiskey more traditional sherry finished Irish whiskey or more bourbon heavy influence whiskey. Please like and subscribe and comment below if there's another whiskey you'd like me to review. Slash up.